Hello. I'm so excited to share a brilliant book with you today. This is Scaredy Bat, written by Jonathan Merries and illustrated by Anders Frank. And it's been shortlisted for the Bookbug Picture Book Prize 2023. Scaredy Bat is a really fun book about a little bat who can't sleep and has to face his fear of the light. Let's take a look. Night was fading in the dark, dark wood. Light was dribbling in and filling up the cracks. Things were stirring. Wings were whirring. The sun was yawning and day was dawning. It was morning in the dark, dark wood. But not all creatures were waking and shaking. In a hollow of the old oak tree, Big Bat, Middle Bat and Little Bat snuggled up and closed their eyes. All night long they'd fizzed and whizzed. Now it was time to rest and dream upside down dreams. Can't sleep, said Little Bat. Shh, Little Bat, said Middle Bat. It's getting early. Yes, said Big Bat. If you don't go to sleep, you'll be tired in the evening. Little Bat closed his eyes much tighter. But the dark, dark wood was getting lighter, shining brighter. The air full of buzzing bzzz, and humming mm, and drumming. <laughs> little Bat didn't like it, not one little bit. Can't sleep, said Little Bat. You're not scared of the light, are you? grinned Big Bat. No, said Little Bat. You are, you are, <laughs> laughed Middle Bat. Scaredy Bat, Scaredy Bat, na 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 na. Scaredy Bat, Scaredy Bat, na 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 na. Sang Middle Bat and Big Bat together. Little Bat fluttered to the entrance of the hollow, knew what he had to do, had to show the other two did not find the teasing pleasing, knew that it was time for leaving. Where are you going? said Big Bat. Outside, said Little Bat bravely. Ooh, said Middle Bat. Look out for the bogey bat. And things that go bump in the day, said Big Bat. Scaredy bat, scaredy bat, na 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 na. Scaredy bat, scaredy bat, na 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 na. Sang Middle Bat and Big Bat together. Little Bat peered out from the old oak tree. The dark, dark wood wasn't dark anymore. Little Bat not feeling quite so sure. But with a one, two, three, and an upside down wee! He spread his wings and let go. Little Bat fizzed and whizzed. He zoomed and vroomed. He swooped and whooped and looped the looped. He weaved in and out of branches, turning cartwheels in the air. <gasps> Little Bat felt brave. Little Bat felt good. Little Bat felt like king of the dark, dark wood. But, just when he thought there was nothing to worry about, nothing to hurry or scurry back home about, Little Bat had a feeling he wasn't alone. Saw something flicker, heart beating quicker. Hard not to think that it must be the bogey bat! Ah! Shrieked Little Bat, sensing disaster, vrooming and fizzing and whizzing much faster. But wherever Little Bat flew, the bogey bat flew too. Until Little Bat began to see there was nothing to be scared of. The bogey bat was just his shadow. Whee! 
went Little Bat, heading for home, pretending that he'd always known. Back in the hollow of the old oak tree, Big Bat and Middle Bat started to wonder, grew more worried by the minute, wanted Little Bat back in it. Where could he be? said Big Bat. Go and see, said Middle Bat. No, you go and see, said Big Bat. Let's both go and see, said Middle Bat. Big Bat and Middle Bat peered out of the hollow, both afraid that the other wouldn't follow, listening for things that went bump in the day. They were scared of the light, but they didn't like to see. Big Bat and Middle Bat watched and waited, wishing Little Bat would come back to the tree again. And then, boom, went Little Bat suddenly appearing. Ah, ah, screamed Big Bat and Middle Bat together. Scaredy Bat, scaredy Bat, na 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 na, sang Little Bat with glee. Back in the hollow of the old oak tree. Why don't you talk to your friends about what helps you to fall asleep? You could even make routine cards showing all the things you do to get ready for bed. You can share them with us online using hashtag BookBugPrize. Thanks for joining me. I hope you like reading or listening to the other books on the BookBug Picture Book Prize shortlist. But don't forget to vote for your favourite by the 27th of January 2023. Bye!